South Korea and Japan have agreed on how much they can fish from each other's exclusive seas over the next year and a half. After a six month halt, of fishing will resume next week. Through June this year, the quota will be based on an average over the past three years. And the new agreement, effective starting in July for a year, keeps both countries' fishing quotas at 860 ships and 60,000 tons. As for the most contentious part of the agreement, Japan will be allowed to test operation of a 199 ton fishing boat over the next five years, while South Korea can catch an additional 50 tons of cutlass fish from Japanese waters.